It's a mystery. Well, hello and welcome back to the Humble Horologist. My name is Anthony and we're doing something a little bit differently today. I'm not in my quote-unquote studio because here in Tennessee it is 14 degrees and I have no heat in that part of the house. So we're in another part of the house doing a new kind of video. We're, doing, we're going to do an unboxing, but not your normal kind of unboxing, a mystery unboxing. Why do I say mystery? It's because I have here in this massive box a watch, and I have no idea what it's going to be. I have no idea why, who made it. I don't know what it looks like. I don't know anything about it other than the fact that my friend Ross Gallen has sent me this box with a watch in it for me to review. The only thing I've got to do is do an unboxing and then do a review. That's all. That's the only requirement. That's our deal. And so he's going to send me watches. I'm going to review them, but I don't know what I'm getting each time. How fun is that? So what are we going to do? We're going to unbox this watch and see what's inside there. Oh, by the way, this is my dog, George. George is a good dog, isn't he? Say hello, George. And what's on my wrist? What is on my wrist is my Spinnaker SP5062, which is a big old watch. I love it. Not a problem. I want to do a video on it someday. Emerald green even. Awesome watch. Let's flip this around and look at what's in this box. All right, here we have the box. And I'm having to pull my camera up like, I don't know, 10 feet above this thing just to get it into the, <laughs> into the frame. What kind of watch would come in a box this big? All I know is there's some orange involved with it. So let's get to untaping this. And we'll get right into it. There we go. Voila. Da, da, da. Well, we know it's packaged. Oh, look at there. This is interesting. A big box for a little watch. And what is the name? Roebuck. Roebuck Watch Company. Have any of you ever heard of a Roebuck watch before? I think I have. But we're going to take a look at this one. Okay. So here we have it a little bit closer. So what the deal is, is that I put out a call to micro brands and ask if I could uh, get them to send me things that I would send back, just as long as I could review them. Now, I knew it was a long shot to ask such a bold question as a small new YouTuber, but... I did get some response from some people, and particularly from Mr. Ross, and he sent me this Roebuck, and we're going to take a look at it and see what it's all about. So it definitely, I, you know, I think he put this with this, I guess. I do not know what this is. I'm assuming this is extra straps or something, maybe, but we'll open it up and take a look at it in just a second. Here we have a carrying case, not your typical box, I would say, and uh, it feels nice. It's very well made. It's very solid, and let's see how it opens up. Ah, and look, there's the watch. Does this come out? Yes, it does. I'll lay this aside. We're hitting the camera. Interesting. It's a nice little carrying case. All right, so let's take a look at this a little closer and see what we got here. So this is a Roebuck. And what are my first impressions? Well, it looks like it's a combination of things. It looks like a... A sports watch. It looks like a 
racing watch. It looks like a diver in a way, maybe. It's sort of dressy. It's definitely got a different case design than your average watch. And uh, has an internal rotating bezel. Has a textured dial that is pretty cool. And uh, you know, I have no idea what the name of the watch is. I don't know anything about the company. And that is what we're going to find out in, as I do the research and tell you all about it when we do a full review on this Roebuck watch. It's got a very nice strap, has a sign buckle. And uh, if I can get it in right angle on the camera. Hmm, very nice. So we'll get back into this, or we'll look into it, and get back with you guys, and have a full review in the coming week or so, along with some other new videos. Hope you look forward to it. And if you have any comments or thoughts or any experience with a Roebuck watch, then uh, why don't you leave it in the comments below and we'll talk about it in preparation for the upcoming full review. All right, George and I thank you for watching and I hope that you come back to watch the whole full review. And oh, now what are you fussing about? You were wanting to be in this video so bad and now you're not even wanting to be up in my arms. He's very temperamental.